Today, there was a judgment in the appeal court between wicked boys and Fubara. And Fubara is beating them with a bit in court. Let me explain what happened. You know, say, well, after the whole election thing, uh, Fubara and win in our government. We've asked to get to something House of Assembly members. All of them are PDP. When Fubara and Wiki should go start. The guys that are loyal to Wiki in the House of Assembly, now they pack their bag. They say they're not the PDP. They say that they go APC. By the constitution of Nigeria, you cannot just get up and cause carpet to another party because that's since you sit down. Not you get on and the party get on. So if you say you no more do again, you get up, the party will put another person for their seat for the House of Assembly. Unless there's a crisis in the party, that's the only time you can defend. Which is what is happening in the House of Assembly. What the Labour Party members, they jump, go APC. When problem, not the Labour Party, they claim the problem day. But you know, say that side, Labour Party not get power to fight them. But Fubara, <laughs> when God created an hard bill, and one Lord, neither rights for a CV, I think the governor, he won't just never know. So Fubara ready for fight. So the only thing I said, I don't cause carpet. Fubara say that's good. You are no longer House of Assembly members. Again, only four people. Now not cross carpet for the full University House of Assembly. So as far as Fubara is concerned, now that four, now the House of Assembly members. Now, a governor cannot buy water with the state money without it being in the budget. And the governor will not be the one to sign the budget. The House of Assembly now go sign the budget. That time, whether we are the they cross carpet. When Fubara, they insist, say they are no longer House of Assembly members. That four, we not cross carpet too. Fubara just carry the budget, go meet that four. <laughs> That's what just signed up. Four people signed full budget. The other 20, 30, what else can be called go court? Say the budget is illegal because they're not day when they sign the budget. Fubara also will not be lawmakers again because they don't cost carpet. Therefore, say you see also we sign later, say we cost carpet. Fubara say, we not going talk. <laughs> According to what they tell us, we not go APC. So we have only four people that are in the house of assembly. So they went to court. The federal high court. God support those other 20 something House of Assembly members. God sell the Attorney General of the Federation say the money with the country they give real estate every month made a stop her. Until Fubara write another budget, go give that 20 something people. So it's only boy they be wicked boys. <laughs> if they sign a man, no way to cost her. The court asked the uh, uh, Attorney General of the Federation, say whether they give real estate money again, until Fubara go drop another budget. The money will be it already get because we've it has accounts with any bank and assets bank. The way they already get for the account, the court was work the banks not to allow Fubara to assess the money. Fubara is not the joke. This fight, we will fight this fight anywhere. So Fubara appealed the court, the case, and they went to the appeal court. Today, somebody said today, Avoko, today, the appeal court has decided that Fubara is correct. That as a matter of fact, the federal high court that gave that judgment does not have the right to pull out in that kind of matter. Neither the court for English, they don't have the jurisdiction to judge that matter. They say that court too small to judge matters like federal location. So immediately, Zen Bank and Access Bank has been ordered to allow Fubara to be flexible with the money. This is why that they tell you so, eh? Fubara, that they buy motor, the one one by the eh, MSCDC. He does shut, he doesn't expect the state's money. And as this matter they go on, so Fubara is running, you know. So today the appeal court has decided that the federal court does not have the jurisdiction to carry out that judgment. Let me show you the news. The appeal court has set aside all orders restraining the Central Bank of Nigeria and the Accounts General of the Federation from releasing funds to the rival state government. The three member panel presided by Justice Aman Baka held that the subject matter was not within the jurisdiction of the courts relating to the revenue of the state. While allowing the appeal of the River State Government, the appellate court also set aside all the orders made by Justice Joyce Abdul Malik, stating that it was unconstitutional for her to make orders restricting River State Government to receive funds due to the state from its consolidated revenue fund. The appellate court held that the lower court overreached itself 
and didn't have the jurisdiction to entertain the matter. In October, Justice Abdul Malik of the Abuja Federal High Court held that he received a disbursement of monthly allocations since January this year by River State Governor Simnala Ifubara was a breach of the Constitution and an aberration that must not be allowed to continue. The judge held that the presentation of the 2024 budget by Fubara before a four-member reversed House of Assembly was an affront to the constitutional provision. Justice Abdul Malik specifically said that the governor's action was a gross violation of the 1999 constitution. The judge subsequently restrained the Central Bank of Nigeria, the Accounts General of the Federation, Zenith Bank and Assets Bank from further allowing Fubara to assess money from the consolidated revenue and federation account. My own is because if you read up a paper, they go say now Fubara, the House of Assembly members that get a case of court. But me and you know we really get the case. Amen. In our kidney, we came in the inside. For our mind. <laughs> yeah. We came in is there. If not be wish, now you be. Because you are governor of the quarry, you say maybe the full state allocation or call. Maybe full that allocation is not only the governor's money. That allocation is not even the governor's money, it's the state's money. Now for that they will pay salary. Now for that they go child. Now for that they go do this time for that. Just because you are governor for that. Maybe full state no longer key there. Because then you're not with it. <laughs> because then you deal with Tinubu Abuja. This same Tinubu you deal with Abuja. That was the problem. He had with Tolu Shekun of Asenjo and the whole world supported him. Now you are in his cabinet. You want to play that same trick against somebody else. Anyway, we are still in the status quo. The way Nigeria they work. If you, are court, you see, one of the courts in Nigeria that they are supposed to scrap is that appeal court. Their judgment is totally useless. Do you know why? They will appeal the case again and we are going to the Supreme Court. You can win in the federal high court, win in the appeal court, and lose at the Supreme Court. You can win in the federal high court, lose at the appeal court like this matter, and go and win in the Supreme Court. So the final say, now who the Supreme Court might go give up? Meanwhile, everybody will maintain status quo before they go judge this matter because this is why they don't go to the Supreme Court. So now another one year. <laughs> before they go judge this matter, finish. That money, where the cost goes, you could only remain one five. <laughs> you know, the way we used to pay lawyers. Look in this country with it. I love Niger.